Welcome to Frankensight and our YouTube channel, Ask Frank 15. Today, we're going to talk about XPath and CSS selectors in Scrapey. And we're going to use the Scrapey shell to do some demonstrations uh, and look at XML and CSS selectors. So let's use the shell. Frankensite.net. So after the shell has loaded Frankensite.net, we can access the, the response. And the response has a selector attribute. But because it's such a common thing uh, to Scrapey, they've, they've shortened the syntax. So instead of response.selector. CSS or XPath is just response dot XPath or CSS. So let's look at CSS first. So what are we doing here? Uh, with CSS selectors, we're using style sheet attributes to navigate the DOM. And here, we're looking for a div with ID title. And after that, a P with text. So the text in P, the P within the div which has ID of title. Now let's do the same thing with XPath selectors. So we've gotten the same the same data with an XPath selector. What is XPath? XPath is a syntax for defining parts of an XML document. The LXML library allows us to read an HTML document like XML and navigate around it using XPath syntax. So here we're looking for a div, and this is a relative path, so we're not starting at the actual top. Uh, this is going to allow us to jump to the first div for any div uh, with an ID attribute title, and then a P, and then its text, and then extract it. So this has been a short lesson using the Scrapey shell to look at CSS selectors and XPath selectors in Scrapey. If this video has saved you some time, give us a thumbs up.